Hello everyone, it's really a pleasure to be a part of the third UN South Asia Forum on Business and Human Rights. Uh, work from home, online schooling, digital learning has become the new norm, but it has also brought a lot of uh, challenges, a lot of new challenges, emerging challenges. So let me share my uh, presentation for a quick overview of what's happening. This I say is the world 1.0 and the world 2.0 is the digital world. There are all these green dots that you see are the connected devices which are communicating to each other. This screenshot was taken by me today from a website called as internetlifestats.com. And you can see the total number of internet users growing. Uh, it's growing every second. In fact, the moment I speak, we are also gaining a lot of new users on different platforms, whether on Instagram, YouTube, Twitter. People are joining the set of new platforms and being part of the digital world. So then issues that are being targeted to children and young people are cyberbullying, cyberbullying uh, like defamation and exposure, intimidation, uh, issues like online sexual abuse that include sexual harassment, blackmailing and financial extortion, online sexual abuse, uh, materials are being circulated, commercial sexual exploitation and trafficking is happening through the cyberspace, radicalization is happening, then there are online attacks and frauds like attacks on devices, malware infections, farming, identity theft, hacking of accounts, hacking of social media accounts, privacy breaches, uh, issues like stalkerware, which, which we found uh, is the recent issue that uh, children and young people are facing, wherein they get a tempting link, and once they click on the tempting link, a kind of a backdoor gets installed in the phone silently, which accesses the camera, which accesses the communications, and then causes them further harm. Online enticement is also happening. Cyberpeace Foundation did a landscape analysis of online technology and different technology, like different chat forums, social media accounts, social media platforms, uh, even different platforms were kind of seen and uh, what the analysis was done. And what we found out was issues like uh, bullying and sextortion is on the rise, live streaming and on demand services. Uh, wherein people is a full-fledged gang that reaches out to those people, uh, especially in the tribal areas, reaching out to them with a small set-up amount, asking the head of the family to strip the daughters in front of a camera live. So that kind of cases have also increased. Now people have gone into uh, the next level, wherein they also offer like a customization services uh, to people who are in different countries. People pay for uh, the service, they can demand anything like a penetration of a particular kind or the names written on the private parts of the, uh, of the, of the child and further abuse them only through the live streaming and on demand services. Issues like sextortion is on the rise, commercial sexual exploitation and trafficking is happening. In fact, uh, you know, what we are seeing, uh, the latest pattern is the first kind of connect happens through the uh, technologies and through the cyberspace and then uh, later on the trafficking happens through these platforms and twin platforms and different social media platforms. Even, even the dark web is a very, very major role. So it's the combination of the surface web and dark web. We've also seen increase in the child self-generated sexual content. Online gaming, there have been issues that have been caused through online gaming. Children have been targeted through the online gaming platform. There have been issues related to electronic addiction. Uh, there have been certain, certain major issues related to child sexual abuse material. I'll be covering it later. Uh, we have released certain reports also, and, and uh, the kind of reports that have come out brings out the issues. It's not just the dark web, but also the surface web and different platforms that are actually operating on the surface web. A lot of content related to child sexual abuse are being circulated. So this is just a word cloud and, and uh, the research that uh, we had kind of done. Uh, we had developed a crawler and through the crawler we were able to crawl uh, certain platforms and, and uh, again making use of certain text uh, or all keywords. We were able to get plenty of data related to uh, child sexual abuse material and also exploitation of children. 
thank you uh, thanks to vinit uh, you know for sharing uh, that uh, uh, the situational analysis with regard to child online safety uh, range of vulnerabilities range of safety issues for children and young people in the online world